Elderflower was once described as the scent of summer. The magical white flowers form in clusters and come from the elder tree, which can be found throughout the whole of the UK. In late summer, the flowers develop into purple berries and they attract many curious insects with their sweet fragrance. The berries can be made into elderflower wine, elderflower liqueur, elderflower cordial, and even elderflower champagne. It has a wonderful refreshing taste, especially when added to sweets and desserts, and is best served chilled, but always cook the berries first as they shouldn't be eaten raw. Elderflowers can be eaten cooked, used as a decoction or infusion, such as elderflower tea, or made into tinctures, supplements, tablets and creams. Many cultures have used elderflowers for centuries as they are known for their natural antiseptic and anti-inflammatory properties. They are used to fight colds, flu and chest infections such as bronchitis, catarrh, for nose and throat allergies, hay fever, earache, sinusitis and rhinitis. They are a natural diuretic and can also be used as a laxative and they help with fevers as they are known to increase sweating. Elderflowers contain vitamin C and vitamin A. They are useful for reducing pains with arthritis, with rheumatism, gout, measles and chillblains, and help to lower blood sugar levels and blood pressure levels, assisting with poor circulation and regulating glucose levels. They help keep our eyes healthy and make a wonderful eye wash, helping to prevent conjunctivitis. They can also help to alleviate the pain from sunburn and bites and stings. Studies have shown that elderflower is effective in eliminating bacteria, which is found in hospitals such as MRSA, and can also help in fighting cancer cells. They give our immune systems a boost, assisting to keep us in good health, proving them a very worthy natural remedy and more than just a sweet scent.